tutorial on how to play What I Missed Most by Callum Scott. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. The chords we need to know are a C, an open F chord, and a minor, and a G. If you know how to play those chords, feel free to skip ahead. For now, I will be teaching you how to play those. For your A minor, your index finger will go on the first fret of the B. That's your second string up, one, two strings up. Your middle finger will go on the third string down, one, two, three strings down of the second fret, that's your D string, and your ring finger will be tucked under on the second fret of the G, which is your third string up, one, two, three strings up. For your A minor, you play all your strings except for this top E. There's your A minor chord. To get to your C chord, you simply take your ring finger off and slide him all the way up to this third fret of the a string, which is your second string down, one, two strings down, and again, we're not playing this low E when we play this chord. For your F chord, stay in the same position, but now move your middle finger down one string to the uh, second fret of the G, third string up. Ring finger is going to stay in the same place on that third fret of the A string, and your pinky is going to come in on the third fret of the D string. your F chord. You don't want to play this high E and you don't want to play this low E, so you're just trying to play these chords, or these strings, sorry, in the middle of the outer strings here. So, that's your F chord. For your G chord, your ring finger goes on your third fret of your high E, that's your bottom most string here, all the way over on the third fret. Middle finger goes on the third fret of the low E, and your index goes on the second fret of the A, and you play all six strings for your G chord. Okay, so those are the chords. Let's start talking about the progression now. So the tricky part about the verse is going to be the finger picking. And if you don't want to do the finger picking, I'll teach you how to do an alternative strumming. <coughs> be the same as what's strummed in the chorus, but we're going to start out here with the finger picking. So you're going to be in your C position to start out, and you're going to simultaneously pick your D string and your B string. So this string is the D string and this string is the B string, you're going to simultaneously pick those, and then you're going to pick your G, and now you're going to alternate picking between your G string and your B string. So, do that once, then you go to your F chord, same strings are going to be picked simultaneously, and then there's something a little tricky about that F chord, it's that hammer on with the pinky, you don't have to do that if you can't do that, but what you do is you pick simultaneously G, B, G, B hammer on. If you can't do that, that's okay, just do those two strings at the same time and then alternate between your G, B, G, B. Next we're going to go to our A minor chord, we're still picking the same strings. And then we're going to drop all our fingers for our G chord, or you can just go ahead and um, go to your G position. You'll see that we're not actually playing any of those strings with this position on, so you could just leave your hand off. It's up to you. Uh, but you can go to your G position, and then do the same picking pattern, except for on the last B, go ahead and slide your index finger to the B string. And then it's back into the um, <coughs> progression, starting with the C chord. So I'm going to go through this a couple times really slowly. F. A minor. To your G. That's all there is to it for the verse. So, <clears throat> the chorus has a strumming pattern, and you can substitute the strumming pattern since it's the same progression. For
for the verse if you don't want to do the finger picking. And it sounds like this. So we're starting on our C, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, A minor, G. Nice and slow, down. Okay, so let's walk through that a couple more times here, even slower. <clears throat> so down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down. So we're switching from C to F, A minor, to G. And we're always switching after we do an up stroke. So down, down, up, down, up, switch, down, down, up, down, up, switch, down. And at full speed. to it. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. I did go through all that pretty quickly, so feel free to comment below for questions. If you enjoy this content, please subscribe to my channel and also check out my songwriting playlist. Thank you for watching.